The breakout by more than 500 Rohingya refugees from an immigration depot on Wednesday proves that overcrowding is a time bomb at detention centres, claim several human rights groups and activists. They urged the government to address the dire conditions and stop detaining undocumented migrants and refugees in order to address the poor living conditions and overcrowding at these centres. A riot that broke out at the detention centre at Rilau in Bandar Baru Kuda escalated into a breakout with more than 500 Rohingya detainees fleeing the centre. Six of them, however, died in a road accident while making their escape. Those killed were two men, two women, a girl and a boy. Heidi Kwa, the founder of Refuge for the Refugees, said the huge number who fled from the centre proved that it was overcrowded. She said that living in unacceptable conditions while being denied access to basic human rights for a long period of time could have led to the riot and breakout. It is a waiting game for them. Most are being detained indefinitely without a chance of release and this is clearly a violation of human rights, she told FMT. Kwa said there was a need for collaboration between the government and NGOs to improve the conditions at these detention centres, adding that the NGOs were more than ready to work with Putrajaya. Tanaganita Executive Director Glorine Das called for independent organisations such as the Malaysian Human Rights Commission and civil society groups to be allowed to visit these centres to ensure they complied with international standards. The United Nations High Commissioner for Refugees should be given access to process the documents of refugees so that preparations for resettlement can be hastened, she told FMT.